Okay, so the character creator can be accessed by pressing on the new button here. Then just click on the character creator button in the object library. Let's see how easy it is to make a character. We'll start with a male character and give him the name Jones. Now using the customize panel, we can easily make changes to each part of the character. First, let's choose a head type. So now let's choose a hairstyle for our soldier. Ah, oh, this one will do nicely. Now for a matching moustache. <laughs> Maybe something a little bit more subtle. Yes, that looks better. Next, we'll choose some headgear. This cap looks good. Let's now give him some cool sunglasses. Now for his body clothing. We'll fit him out with the winter camouflage outfit. And finally some pants and boots. Now then if you tick the advanced setting checkbox, you'll open the animation panel. Here you can preview all the animations that the character can perform. You can change the speed of the animations and view the internal bone structure in action. You can choose a weapon for the character here. We'll give him a revolver. With this setting, when the player kills this character, we choose how much ammo the player can pick up. Now it's time to save the character. The final task is to design the thumbnail. You can move and zoom the character and change the backdrop. So here we go, here's the character in the user section of the object library. Let's select him and place him into the 3D world. Ah, he looks great in the snow theme level. The character creator also lets you design female characters. And for the horror fans, there are male and female zombies too. So, get started making your own characters. It's really easy to do and there's a huge range of options.